uh, in that sutra, he taught how to practice as well. Here he just described the, the land and the marriage. But in that prison, he told her how to imagine, you know. He described it all, and then he said, you have to imagine and fix your mind on that with the name of Amitabha Buddha. You know, do it day and night as much as you can. And then when you die, you'll be born in that land. That's another occasion of the Amitabha uh, Sutra, a little different, with the advice of how to practice. Yeah, Just concentrate, you know, and imagine. Remember all the things that he described and fix your mind on it <laughs> in detail. And remember the name of Buddha, then you'll be born there. Or you could even visit there, he said, while alive. Yeah, Something like that. So, plan B, plan B, eh? Mm. <laughs> what, love? No? Prefer plan A? <laughs> it don't matter, as long as you're free. Yeah? Wherever you're born, as long as you're free, and you continue your uh, freedom searching, then it's fine with me, okay? Mm. I just read it to you because uh, it's interesting to know about other lands, other masters, other Buddhas, yeah? Mm. It's good to... because you still have to live in the shadow world, you know? You can't follow me later on, but I will be there also. Doesn't mean I'm here, doesn't mean I'm only here, yeah? Yeah, because the soul can stretch infinitely. So the Tim Kotu <laughs> is enjoying up there while I'm toiling down here. <laughs> a part of it. You see what I mean? Like a string like this. Huh? Okay. And at the end is a microphone. Yeah. And the other end is a zig and zag and plug and... You see what I mean? Yes. Yeah. It's the same line. Yeah? Okay? If Tim Putu was to be only in the original universe after he or she refound it, then the job here cannot take care. It's too far, too separated, too different too much different from the shadow and the real. And also, she, he, Tim cannot go to hell sometimes, if necessary, to fish out some difficult <laughs> fish, okay? Mm. The fish that Jesus mentioned, <laughs> I teach you how to fish human. Okay. That is the fish I'm talking about. So she here, the Tim is in the world, is acting as a human connection, yeah? So the human can see and hear and benefit. The other part of teams are all over in the universe. Remember the string, the whole string of the universe? So the team in the astral world is a different. The team in second world different the team. The same, the same, it just, just not so bound like here, not so difficult to work. You know? Even in astral world, people are already very easy to teach. Second world, third world, not to mention fourth, fifth. Um, but uh, the, if you see Tim in the astral world, you fall in love already. Not to talk about the second world team or the third world team or fourth or fifth. The human team look like a human, behave like a human, has also power. But in this world, have to connect with the higher team so that uh, slowly, you know, extend the power here and gradually. Okay. Number one, because the team's uh, human team body is, is not as the body of astral team or, you see, has to go all the way from the original team all the way down slowly. <laughs> More power, a little less, a little less, a little less, a little less, a little less power until human world, okay? Because if it come all the way from our original team immediately, then this world will be destroyed immediately. Cannot survive that power. So the human team is necessary to re-digest and relocate it to suit the human's capacity of uh, receiving and digesting. That's why it takes so long. Yeah. And the human team 
uh, can receive the power also gradually, you know, cannot do it all at once either. Yeah. So we may be able to say that the human team doesn't contain as much power as the original team. But because this world is like that, even if the human team contains all the power of the original team, then the world cannot also receive, cannot, ex- cannot digest, cannot, cannot uh, perceive it, cannot receive it, cannot be all given out. It's too much, too much. Human body, human mind cannot bear, and the whole planet, trees, plant, everything. So it has to do slowly. Huh? So the human uh, team look like uh, a normal person, but inside has more power than normal person. But even then, must train, you know, must slowly, slowly for the cells and the mind to be ready for all that. Also, take long time, many years, many, <laughs> many ten years already. Yeah, the astro team is even more beautiful already. Yeah. And the higher you go, the more glorious, the more beautiful the team. <laughs> and the original team is for, oh, yeah, <laughs> cannot describe. It's too much light, you know, too bright, too radiant, too glorious, too, too everything. <laughs> so, but the team in the original world is doing the original work, yeah. And the team from different levels is doing different work. The same team, mm, same team, but uh, different power, different function, uh, different blessing. Same, same one. If the world here were able to receive all the blessing, then the team also bring it all down. The same, it just cannot. So no need, you know. Yes, like uh, if you need the small room only. You don't don't need uh, such a big light, so you use just small lamp. Yeah, okay. Yes, you don't need even though electricity in your house is very strong, can provide many things. But you don't need for such a small room. Or if you just light uh, the bed light lamp, you know, bed lamp, and you don't need a lot of electricity. It's small bulb. Not because your electricity not enough. Just no need. Huh? Okay. And uh, every team has a different function in different world, but they're all connected. Yeah. And this team can also manifest in different planets, not just one planet, many planets, many cosmos, many uh, planes of spiritual existence. And look alike or may not be look alike. It depends. If that planet has uh, people with uh, two nose, then team over there we have two nose too. Otherwise, they think, "Who are you?" <laughs> so it's, it depends on the beings, yeah. And if the uh, the planet there have uh, the people with certain certain temperament, then the team has to also adapt to that, to to help them accordingly, yeah. Cannot be too good. And cannot be too bad. <laughs> Has to be almost look like, apparently, apparently look similar to the beings of that planet, so that they trust. You are one of us. You are us. If if I came here with two nose, what do you think? <laughs> For example, huh? Or the the wisdom eyes is very obvious right here. And <laughs> what do you think, huh? <laughs> Yeah, you and your children will be scared. Oh, oh, monster! <laughs> yes, it's too different, too much. You see, so have to be similar. Uh, I don't know anything else you want to know about Buddha or Tim. Tim Kotu is so so so. How you say? Too friendly. <laughs> too. <laughs> too to the boy next door, you know what I mean? Too much. Yeah. Even many movie stars, they change their name, you know? Like Marilyn Monroe, she wasn't Marilyn Monroe, she was just like Jean. Uh, Jean what? Yeah. Huh? Jean Norman. Yeah. No, Norman. Normal Jean. Normal Jean. Yeah. Very normal. <laughs> but 
change it to Marilyn Monroe. Wow, it's so glamorous. Yeah, already, yes. So I think I changed Tim Kurtu into something, I don't know. I think about it. <laughs> Artistic name, you know, like pen name, yeah? <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, movie star name. Yes, ma'am. I, I read a book and um, it described the a universe like um, the central paradise and uh, there is with uh, several like seven paradise uh, around it and there is a uh, like a big photon belt around this paradise a big one huh? belt? gravitation belt gravitation yeah. belt yeah, yeah and yeah. this book reveals like many things and um, like there are seven big universes super universes around the, the central paradise yeah yeah and I was wondering if this was the um, the central paradise. It was the something like the original universe. Is that or uh, it's just no. the description of the second no, no. world? Anybody from this planet can know about it, except him. Then is he is not from original universe. Okay. Understand? Yeah. But is this one of like Buddha's land? He uh -huh. also surrounded with seven this, seven that. Similar like that. Because, yeah, there is the description that, and that um, our universe is one of, is in one of these super universe. Yours? Yeah, we are like in the... Yeah. They are divided in many sections. Yeah, and yeah, are but like that a, universe is better than this universe. Uh, you know, that uh, land is better than our land. Yeah. It could be in the same universe, it's just different level of consciousness, okay? And it's always the... Which, which level of consciousness does it belong to? Like, it's like second level or... Uh, that one? It's, give me a name. Uh, like, this, uh, we don't have... Uh, the central paradise is named ha Havona. Havona. Havona? Havona. Havona. Sounds already better than Tim. <laughs> Sounds more, sounds more paradise-like, you know? You know, like those science fiction stuff, they know an even better name. Third level. Okay, yeah. Man, not many people can reach a fifth level already, so mostly things that they see or describe are either astral, second or third level, or max four level, maximum. Oh, any more question? Yeah, here. Yeah. Nasa, I just want to say thank you for never giving up on us. You're welcome. <laughs> Sometimes I, I mean, when I hear some of the things you tell, even here, about the people who do something really not right, but you still help them. Mm -hmm. You know, you still, you help them even directly now or maybe in the case of people that they go to think about things, you will help them any time mm. that someone asks. I know oh, that from my own experience. Mm. And even when I don't have faith in myself, I, if I pray, I, I feel your faith in me. And so it's, you know, that's just an unbelievable gift. And you, you do that for everyone, everything, every being. So of thank course, you. Madam. Of course, even if I throw them out, don't think I, I left them. No, just one of the eighty-four thousand means <laughs> to teach ascended beings, <laughs> according to Buddha. <laughs> yeah, uh, a master is not always being nice. Understand? You, you like sweetness, so it's bad for your teeth. Yeah, <laughs> sugar, candies, cakes. Sweet, but it's not always good for us, okay? Same, same, same with treatment with the ma from the Master. Jesus has to go into the temple and then throw out and scold all these money mongols in there <laughs> and uh, many other things, okay? Yeah. Buddha also. Mm, doesn't matter, I just do my job. I, I don't leave anyone, they just left me. And then I wait, and then I wait. 
until their heart comes back, not their body comes back, their heart. Now, sentient beings are very difficult, very difficult. Each one is more difficult than the next. So, in different ways, okay? Yeah, no problem, no problem. Even if uh, the parents they don't leave their children, so how how a spiritual master leave anyone? <laughs> it's normal, okay? It's normal. It just have to do it in different way. Yeah, different per- person treat differently. Yeah. Uh, sometimes two people ask the same question, but I answer differently or treat them differently. Two person do the same thing, but a tri- different treatment because of the inside. Not the outside action or question, okay? Love you. (laughs) It looks so humble. Passionate viewers, we appreciate your company for today's episode entitled Buddhist Stories, The Land of Amitabha Buddha, Part 6 of 7, on Between Master and Disciples. 